watching out for you. This is KZI 9 News at 11. As dreams of a new city hall become a reality, the Eugene City Council gets an update on the rebuild project. Thanks for staying up with us tonight. I am Brian Richardson. Tonight at a city council work session, architects presented what the new design might look like. KZI 9 News reporter Sarah Hurwitz is live in Eugene with reaction from the councilors and the community in our top story here at 11. Sarah. Well, counselors and the community had mixed reviews on the new design, but they did all agree that they'd like to preserve the iconic elements of the old city hall. Architects say that that's an important factor in their new concept design. It won't be long before these fences come down as a new city hall takes shape. It's really one of looking at how city hall and how the community come together. Each of those entities has its own autonomy, but there's definitely an area of overlap. At Monday night's work session, city councilors got a peek at a greener city hall. How the project's evolving, you'll see that simplicity actually is one of, uh, if we're, if we're following through on that. A design that boasts ample windows, allowing for a more transparent government. That idea of a shared community ground plane where city government and the community can come together, not just to do city business, but to do uh, things like uh, community book clubs or public events. I like that very much. I like that people can see their government at work, and, uh, and that part was uh, interesting to me. Instead of two stories, the design will likely be three to five, and it will fit on one half of a block. But Councillor Betty Taylor was not on board with the idea, saying that the council is throwing away a piece of history. I think we've been a throwaway society, and we have destroyed much of our history already in Eugene. If it ain't broke, why fix it? Why spend 15 million or 20 million to tear the thing down, grade it, and then they're only going to build 30% of the square footage of what it is now. And some people echo Taylor's comments, worried that it's too soon to say goodbye to this stairway to the past. Now, architects say that they will keep part of that democratic circular form of the council chambers. Now, other people brought up concerns about the potential city county land swap, which would change the design plans a bit. This is a $15 million project, and there is no construction date set just yet. Live in Eugene, Sarah Hurwitz, KEZI 9 News.